Well, I'm Alice Baumgartner and I'm 18 years old and I'm a senior at the Latin School of Chicago. Well, I've been really involved in Africa issue, well, African issues ever since middle school, basically. And so, and I'd especially become interested in genocide when I was in eighth grade and I read um, Philip Gorevich's book, We Wish to Inform You That Tomorrow You'll Be Killed With Your Families, while we were doing the Holocaust unit. And throughout the entire unit, our teacher never mentioned that there were more genocides going on. And no one else in my class had ever even heard of Rwanda. And they, everyone kept on saying, you know, never again, never again. And I thought that was so hypocritical. Just sophomore year, I read this editorial in the New York Times about um, what they considered to be a genocide going on in Sudan because the US at that time hadn't um, declared it a genocide yet. And so that's when I really, um, got started and started this activism group in my school and just things got rolling from there basically. I had this idea that maybe if we could get cameras to the kids in Sudan then they could take pictures from their own perspective and it wouldn't just be you know a media perspective and to me that seemed really important just because from my own interest in Darfur it wasn't it was really being able to empathize with the kids there that really like, kind of sparked my passion for Darfur. The kids in these pictures aren't just, you know, they aren't the kids on the, on the TV commercials who are trying to get you to give money and they're just some far away African problem. That they're real people who are really suffering and who need, who need help. There was this one picture that I really liked that we weren't able to put in the photo exhibit because it was too blurry. It was this like little boy who was sitting there in in one of the tents reading this book and looking at the pictures and it was it was just so cute and he was like clearly very happy sitting there reading his his book and I just I thought that was really just 
a really inspiring picture.